beautiful people, beautiful people of the internet. We are down at the barn. I've got my gloves, my beautiful Kunkel riding gloves. These are show riding gloves and I'm not gonna be able to use them because my horse is having a nine month break. So I'm gonna put them in my drawer here. You couldn't see the bird? Save them. You saw a bird? Was it dead? That was what Daisy was chasing. Oh. And I was yelling to the bird to come here. <laughs> All right, house. hurry up and feed. Go the right, hold on here. Anyway, good morning. Welcome to our chaotic life. All right, Penny Pickle. You ready for this? I don't think she likes this. Yeah. Yeah. You get braver days. Here, I know. I think you like it. It has to happen. Oh. I need two hands to squirt the medicine in because the syringe sucks. Open up. Ah! Oh girl, she does not like it. She does not like it. You do not like it, but you're covered in poo, Missy. You're covered in poo. All right, one more time. We have to do it, Pen. We have to do it. She's so good. I can't get it. So uh, this is the problem. We only have one syringe at this house and it doesn't squirt. It's like, it's like cement. I can't get it to squirt up there. And so it's impossible to get the medicine in her. I should go and buy another syringe. I have this little, whoops. I have this little tawny syringe, but I can't get the stupid thing out of the container. Can you get this one out? I think somebody jammed it on there somehow. If you guys can see, it says, but first let me overreact on my shirt today. Hopefully it's not an... Hopefully it's not an overreacting kind of day. I thought you thought I had muscles. <laughs> Sophie says, I love how you thought I had muscles. Yeah, I know. I'm still sleeping. Yeah, we're still sleeping. That's what happens when you have a farm. You still sleep. All right. What am I gonna do? I have to get a proper syringe. Like I can't even manage it anymore. It's that annoying. On a positive side, we've pretty much got all the medicine you can need. We have a metrazole. We have antihistamines. We have bute. We have banamine. We have, like, you name it, we've got it. Why is there a horse in the bag? Yeah. That's from grooming them. All right, let's get moving. You know what I read? I read that this morning, I read that na animals naturally move away from people and that they don't think like them. And they move towards people that they do think like them. Anyway. Uh, Penny's gone to the point now where she just loves us all and accepts us all. Does your horse need a grooming? No, she won't. She, no, she has a blanket on. Yeah, we're gonna have to put blankets on maybe because it's gonna rain. Your horse need a blanket or a grooming, Gabby, before she goes out? Not as much as yours. <laughs> Not as much as mine? Well, I'm gonna do mine right now. Hold on when you need a friend, I'll never let you go again. Reach out when your mind's uneasy, cause I'll understand. Hold on when you need a friend, I'll stay here to the end. You know, this horse has a lot in common with you, Gabby. She likes to take her time. She likes to savor her meal. You know, I don't do that. She likes to go slow. This time, all it needed was a little spark. Give me my heart back, somebody stole. You know what happened? Sophie had uh, one of her TikToks. She's been a TikToker for a while now. She took over her account and just has been being a crazy TikToker. And uh, one of her recent videos blew up, got so many views, and she's like so excited about it. But. The topic of the video that blew up had me in it. It was just a silly video and it had me in it. So now she thinks that if she does videos with me, that they're gonna blow up, which is just silly. And so she's in there doing a TikTok with my horse to see if she can get more views. So go ahead over onto her TikTok, which is I think Finn and Sophie, and blow up her latest TikTok so that she can really believe that I am amazing. <laughs> Blew up as in 3,000 views. Does that only have 3,000 views? Okay, but how many does her other? 3,000 likes. Oh, okay. How many views though? 34,000. 34,000! But that means it just went on a few I know. page and they just went. 
Don't tell her. Don't tell her. Okay. You did it. Oh, that's awesome. All right, let's let the horses out. Guess the horse. Oh, that's the newest one? Guess the horse? Yeah, because what? she wouldn't show her whole face. Oh, she's So shy. it could be Storm or Willow or Gracie or oh. someone. Storm all right. They're all horses and they're all black and white. All right, let's go. Let's do it's this thing. This. Yeah, that's too early for this. I have stuff I have to do today. Fun dog. stuff. Uh oh, where is your dog? Where is my dog? Oh gosh. Uh oh. She's eating poop. I can hear Sophia screaming. <laughs> can you hear you? From one poop pile to the next poop pile. Come on! Come on! Is she coming? Did she catch her? Oh, good girl! So the only way we can get the puppy down, like the, the Molly, the Daisy down to the barn, is to bring her on a leash. It's the only way she'll come. But I think the more we bring her down, the more she'll realize that nothing's gonna hurt her. She has not tried to go out into the paddock again, and she hasn't tried to go under the fence again. So, come on. This dog would do great with electric fencing. Which is kind of my plan for when we move. Give me my heart back, somebody stole it, and put it in your head. And put it in your head. Give me my heart back. Somebody stole it and put it in. Took all the carrots to the barn for the boys. Now I have no carrots to the barn for the girls. So I'm gonna get this. These are two uh, buckets of treats that we have going on now. Maybe we'll go as far as the other one. Because it's my horse? Yeah. I think it's me they love, not my horse. Well, because my other one got, let's see how many views. Um, 34,000 views, and I'll, I got almost 1,000 followers. 1,000 followers? Just almost. From, just for putting me in your in your TikTok? Yeah. Those Ooh. Are tweets. Oh, there's three comments. Penny, 100% Penny. <laughs> penny. <laughs> I know. They know everything. I told my friend the other day, they know everything. And he's like, they don't know everything. I'm like, they know everything. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna post this. How long do you think it's gonna take? Stop. How long do you think it's gonna take before they figure it out? And he's like, they're not gonna figure it out. And I'm like, 20 minutes? And literally, I said 22 minutes. Literally, 19 minutes later, after I posted the picture, people were saying it. And I'm like, yeah, they know everything, you guys. You guys know everything. It's Friday and I wanted to try and get as many chores done as we could before the weekend starts. Yeah, it's Mother's Day weekend. I know I told you guys. So I cut all the grass out here, made it look a lot nicer, clean the barn. I told the girls to go up there having breakfast and getting ready for school. Um, I just wanted to tell you guys it is 10 degrees Celsius, which is about 50 degrees Fahrenheit in the barn. That's what the temperature is, 10 degrees or 50 and it feels like spring. It feels warm and amazing. It's gonna rain, but that's just like a reference for you guys. If you're living in a different climate than us, then you might not, you might, when I say it's like spring out here, you might think like it's 70 or 80, but yeah, it's 50. I will take it, you guys. I'll take any heat that God gives to me. The grass is growing another couple of weeks and we'll be able to put the horses out here full time. Also, these are the daffodils growing in my garden. These are the tulips growing in my garden. There's a hosta I planted uh, last summer. These are some grape hyacinths. They smell really good. Anyway, I think that's what those are. Lots more tulips over here and some red ones. Even though we're in lockdown, you guys, so much to be grateful for. So go out there and look at the beauty that God has given us. Even when things are hard, God always is giving us something to make us happy. You know what's beautiful? What's beautiful? You. Thank you. And I love hugs. Oh my gosh. I love you too, and you're beautiful too. And my dog is too. Yeah, and your sister. Okay, I have to show you guys something. This is super important. Oh, now my subject just disappeared. Daisy, come here. Come here. Okay, so I wanna show you guys something. Come here. Come here. I have a clean laundry here. Come here. Good girl, come on up. Up. Up, come on. So I just told her not, she couldn't come up into the laundry. She loves to sleep with the laundry. But so this is 
a demonstration. This, this is a demonstration on how dogs can read people. Like, she's so good. Okay. People say dogs don't understand emotion. Animals don't understand emotion. Animals don't have emotion. Uh, not everybody says that. Most of you guys know that it's true. But people think that animals... People say don't humanize your animals, and I think animals are just as human as us, to be honest. They might not have as complex thinking processes, but watch this. So she's up here, and she, I just told her she's not allowed, but I want to show you how I tell her she's not allowed. Look at this. You see what happened? I did this to her. I didn't say a word. I didn't change my body temperature. I did this. But hopefully you guys saw it. She cowered and put her head down like she was in trouble for me doing this. And it's because we've taught her that this means no. Not a perfect demonstration, but all I did was this. If somebody walked up to you and did this, would you feel bad? Would you feel sad? Would you cower? Would you go away from what you're doing? No, you would just be like, you're crazy, or you would do it back. But I've taught her, we've taught her, that this means no, you're not allowed to do it. And so, how complex is that though? Like, how complex? We didn't hit her, we didn't follow up this with anything horrible and negative we've we've done this to tell her no and she understands it anyway it might not be a good example and sometimes i i often lack the ability to get across the point that i'm trying to get across but i hope that you guys could see how animals read you they read your emotion they understand your emotion and it is super powerful for me like it's super 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 powerful it's such a, an important message to know that animals want the same kind of existence that we have i feel like okay, let's get to sit in the front seat today well, it's gonna be a fight you guys this will be the first time that so many... grab my wall i call it shotgun so yeah trouble and so basically you guys know gabby always sits in the front so he never gets a chance get to control music and put all the ones she doesn't like to sit in the front you have to be a certain height and a certain weight and you have to like be a certain size and Sophie fits all the criteria she's allowed she never does it and so Gabby's gotten used to trust you. yeah so oh here she comes <laughs> just act cool just act casual just act casual Sophie Sophie act casual Sophie act, act cool calm and collected do, 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 do. Don't, don't smile she's going over there She's gonna look. Oh, oh, oh. Yes! All right. In the car, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> what? What do you mean? She's having a turn. When I drive a car, all the lives are responsible. Like, I'm responsible for all the lives. Like, I'm gonna flip it over. Why? Just because she sat in the... Yeah, get out. Before I <laughs> yank you by your hair. No! Hey, hey be gentle, Gabby. No, 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 no fighting. I don't like sitting <laughs> Oh my god. Sophia, you're braver than you think. Well, I thought for sure she <laughs> So I turned on the camera. I don't trust you. I'm watching Gracie down there. I turned on the camera and... And Gabby, Sophie's like... Eh, I don't trust you. I'm going in the back. All right, so now your horse is all dirty. Okay. Gracie Jess, I just literally witnessed Gracie rolling, not for the sake of rolling, but for the sake of getting completely muddy because she rolled and rolled and rolled and rolled. It's here, you guys, it arrived. I stopped and picked it up. I had to go to the post office, but it's here. You all know what it's like to get a brand new phone. It's exciting, but Gabby wants me to, I wanna, op I wanna open it, but Gabby wants to go to the grocery store. Where you gotta get the grocery store, Gabby? Peace tea. Peace tea, so she'll be peaceful. If I get you peace tea, will you be peaceful? No. <laughs> no. All right, so we stopped at the grocery store. And get uh, the girls got some stuff. Let's see what they got. Gabby got fudgio because you know a girl be needing some fudgio and a free box. Yep. So what kind of peace tea do you drink? Peace tea should sponsor us. Yeah. Um, I drink. This is my favorite flavor. Snowberry. I should remember that. I keep buying her it, and it's she doesn't like it. The stuff I buy. Oh, I got cherry. Cherry. I mean raspberry. Raspberry. Not, not cherry. No. Thank you. Cause I'm trying the raspberry flavor. Oh, and I got peach. Peach. So you got two of one of them? Yeah. 
So just like her dad, utilizing the boxes there. I never but get just boxes. Like, do you want me to put it in a box? I'm like, sure. Oh, that's nice. Enough and box. Sophie picked me up some gum. What'd you get, oh, Sophie? So keep in mind, this is for my TikTok. Okay, it's for a TikTok. Keep in mind. So I can do one. Of Actually, the, we better one. not see what you got. Usually, so I go in free box. Things. So it's one just, of those treat things with you in it again. Oh. I got gummy lifesavers mm -hmm. and these Reese's Minis. That's it. Yeah. yeah. Right, did you tell her no, Sophie? No. No, I was like, let's just break into the chips, cookies. But then you were gonna yell at me. Yeah, that's right. You see, you guys, I'll get them in trouble. I'll be like, no, John. But I got a cute bag. Yeah, so how come you got the bag? Because I was stressed. So, what, Sophie's like me. She gets pressured. She just feels pressured under. I said no. She caves under pressure. Oh, did they ask you if you wanted one? Yeah, and I was like, no. no. And they asked you if you wanted one, and you felt so pressured, you said yes. yes? And I saw it. I thought, oh, they, these were the only bags they had left. Oh. I broke them. I put the piece of me on top of them and I broke them. <laughs> Gabby's broken cookies. That's a lot of cookies, Gabby. I hope you share with your dad. Mm hmm <laughs> No, he's still there. <laughs> Gabby, so somebody came to drop off something. <laughs> Gabby hides behind the door. I'm hiding here. Somebody's hiding there. Do you guys do that? Like... When you order something and the delivery guy comes oh, to drop wait. it off, yeah. Wait, he's still here. We all like. Hey, no, wait. We gotta wait. wait we, we all wait till he goes. Wait, 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 wait. We all wait till he goes because it's kind of awkward. <laughs> it's not done yet. Oh my gosh. Oh, Give me a break. Someone licked my ear. <laughs> Someone licked your ear. <laughs> I think it's for you. So I've been ordering a lot of stuff lately. So because I got a new phone, I needed like a new case and all the stuff that goes with it. So I ordered all that and then I found them other stuff. And then you know how I, looking shopping online leads from one thing to another. And before long, you bought all this junk. So what junk did we get for you, Gabby? Five. Five hours later, Gabby still, don't cut it on the table. Oh my gosh. I caught it. There we go. Not even your birthday. And what did I buy you? I got this. Bring it over here and let's show them. It's smaller than I thought. It is way smaller than I thought. I won't open it. So she got this. I ordered one of these for me. And I decided to order one for her. It's like a charging pad. But it, she can charge her AirPods and her watch all together. And then we won't have to be stressed out in the car having to charge all Gabby's stuff when we're driving places. See, so for Mother's Day, you got a present. For Mother's Day weekend, you got a present. Hey, you got a present too. Well, I, I expect nothing less. <laughs> yeah, right. What about me? Yeah, what are we going to do about Order you? Order me sunglasses. Well, we have to figure something out for you. So this is it with the green. Can you change the color or does it only just stay one color? Like, is that the only option? Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how to work it. Oh. All right. Super well. cute. Penny is mad at us, you guys. We must be late. She must think we're late. She just gave me the head shake. You just gave me the head shake, Pen. Come on, I'll meet ya. Okay, tell the truth. Am I the only one that does not love getting a new phone? Like, it's stressful. Trying to log into all of my accounts and I don't know what any of my passwords are. Where are you, Penny Pickle? Where are you? Oh, got one, two, and three. I actually love this little area of our barn, you guys. It's technically supposed to be a wash stall. But I can't imagine having a bunch of water in here. I love it as our little hay area and all of our storage stuff. Like, I just love this little area. Her foot cleaned out. I can always tell. She always does a funny, but you can always tell that her foot is packed full of this. When she walks on the cement, she does a funny little movement and I can always tell she needs her feet cleaned. All right, that is it for today's video, you guys. Um, I may or may not have spent half the afternoon trying to log into all of my accounts. So if you don't see me on Instagram or TikTok, then you'll know why. Um, I just wanted to tell you guys before I end the vlog that we are going to go live with you guys tonight. We're going to try and play a game, a horsey game. I kind of made it up. 
It's actually a game, but I kind of modified it to, to, to work for us and so that we can play together. It's a horsey game. So I hope to see you guys here. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what time it'll be. I'll post it on Instagram. So I'll watch Instagram and probably around 8 o'clock maybe. Probably around 8 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. Anyway, I hope to see you guys there and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Don't you know that you